our group um, has actually been working in Sierra Leone for about a decade now. Uh, we've been studying another viral hemorrhagic fever called Lassa fever. It's uh, caused by another virus, and it's different than Ebola virus, but the disease outcome, out the way the disease present, presents is very similar to Ebola virus disease. In fact, even a very experienced clinician can't tell the difference between an Ebola virus disease patient and a Lassa fever patient. Very similar disease. Uh, the main uh, manifestation is the fevers and the bleeding and, and uh, multi-system organ failure. The diseases present very much the same way. Um, so mm, we've had a, we have a very serious problem with Lassa fever in Sierra Leone. It's endemic there. It's the highest uh, instance of that disease anywhere in the world. And so now that we have a second hemorrhagic fever there, Ebola virus disease, we're going to be challenged by, you know, how can we tell one patient from the other? We're going to have to make uh, very specific diagnostics to, uh, you know, to distinguish between those two diseases because they require some different management. There's a drug for Lassa virus, for example, that can be given. There's no drug for Ebola.